The Lucy Show. Starring Lucille Ball. Co-starring Vivian Vance. with the football stars on them, the Jerry and Sherman getting their bubble gum. Jerry's lost Johnny Unitas, whoever he is. You don't have him, do you? Listen, if I had a big, strong football player, would I be sitting here darning socks? <laughs> <laughs> hi, Mom. Hi, and Viv. Hello, oh, Chris. Hi, Chris. Chris, did you take Jerry's picture of Johnny Unitas? Why would I want a picture of him? Well, I thought maybe he replaced Frankie Avalon in your affections. <laughs> Mother, please! How can you even think of such a thing? I'll be true to Frankie as long as I live. That's what you said about Ricky Nelson. But that was last month. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Are Frankie Avalon and Ricky Nelson football players, too? Oh, no. <laughs> no, they're singers. The teenagers are crazy about them. They each sold over a million records. No kidding! Yeah. And I never even heard of them. Viv, do you ever get the feeling the world is passing us by? <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> I'll bet Chris never heard of Skinny Ennis either. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there they are. Hi, fellas. Well, hi there. How was school today? Got hit by a little prize going at school dock. Oh, that's a shame. Why? <laughs> what a pity. None of flies from that. Well, I'm sure you'll find somebody. Now, wait just a minute. <laughs> I can't understand a word they're saying. Their football game was called off Friday because they can't find anyone to referee. Oh, that's too bad. How did you understand what they were saying through all that chewing? Well, you forget, I have a daughter who went through that stage. I broke the bubblegum code years ago. <laughs> Honey, why don't you get one of the fathers to referee? I only told you. Sherman, I don't understand bubblegummies. Come on now, take that gum out of your mouth and tell me, why don't you get one of the fathers to referee? All the fathers are working. Or chicken. <laughs> oh, the poor kid. They were counting on that football game. Yeah, it isn't just having the game canceled, but the winning team got to go to Yankee Stadium to see the professional game Sunday. Oh, dear. Gee, it sure is rough on our boys growing up without fathers. Sure is. Hey, why couldn't I referee? <laughs> Lucy, are you chewing bubble gum? <laughs> no, why? It sounded just exactly like you said. Why couldn't I referee? That's what I said. You don't know anything about football. How could you referee? Well, I've watched them on television. All they do is run around, wave their arms, and blow their whistles. <laughs> <laughs> I have a feeling that there's a little more to it than that. Well, why can't I learn about football the same way the kids do? Where are those cards Jerry always carries with him? I'll bet they're right. Sure, here they are. Look at this. Jimmy Brown, fullback. Cleveland Browns, height 6'2", weight 228. Jimmy was the last rookie to lead the league in total yards gained by rushing. 942 yards. Hey, these are marvelous. I think they're terrible. Why? They give all the statistics except how old they are and if they're married. <laughs> Viv, this is not the right time to be thinking about men. There's a wrong time? <laughs> Red Phillips, M, Los Angeles Rams. Height 6'1", weight 199. Last season, Red caught more passes than any other man in the National Football League. Let me see him. Oh, he's cute. <laughs> no wonder he had so many passes thrown at him. <laughs> hey, kids, guess what? I, uh, I got a referee for your game. No kidding! Who? It's me. Whose father's mister? It's me! <laughs> Don't swallow 
about your gum, but I think she means her. <laughs> She's teasing us. No, I'm serious. What do moms know about football? <laughs> Especially you. All right, now, just give me a chance. Last season, who caught the most passes in the National Football League? Gee, I don't know. Do you? Yeah. Do you? Red Phillips of the Los Angeles Rams. Good old 199 pounds, six foot one red. Hey, she's right. <laughs> Go ahead, ask me some more questions. Ask me, for example, who was the last rookie to lead the National League in total yards gained by rushing? All right, who was? Jimmy Brown, the Cleveland fullback, 942 yards. Gee, Mom, that's neat. I'll say. And do you know all the referees' hand signals and everything? Oh, sure. Come on, let's go tell the gang the game's on. Viv, what are hand signals? <laughs> Call <laughs> Harry. Well, if you don't know him by now, you'll never know him. Let's get started. All right. Uh, give me the signal for, uh, offside. Offside. Hey, very good. Thank you. Any questions? Uh, just one. What's offside mean? <laughs> <laughs> offside is when one of the players crosses the line of scrimmage before the ball has been snapped. You got that? Yes, sir. Okay. Now, the next signal... What's a line of scrimmage? <laughs> That's an imaginary line between the offensive and defensive linemen. Oh. Got it? Mm. Now, give me the signal What's for... What's a lineman? <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't it be easier if you got married again before next Friday and let your new husband uh, referee? <laughs> well, I'm sorry now, Harry. I only got as far as the hand signals in the book. All right. I'll teach you the fundamentals later. Now, give me the signal for clipping. Clipping? Clipping. Very good. Now, the penalty for clipping is 15 yards, so you march off 15 yards. Okay. Right. <laughs> Lucy, what are you doing? You give the signal, and then you pace off the yardage. Oh, well, that's good news. Boy, that was murder. <laughs> All right, now, give me the signal for backfield in motion. Backfield in motion? Yeah. Backfield in motion. Right. Now, uh, give me the signal for unsportsmanlike conduct. Unsportsmanlike conduct. Right. <laughs> oh. Uh, is it, uh... <laughs> no, could it be, uh... <laughs> I know it's going to sound silly to you, but this is it. Oh, yes, yes. Unsportsmanlike conduct. That's right. Lou, why don't you forget the whole thing? Maybe I can get one of my fellas to take the flight for me, and I'll do it for you. No, no, I want to be the referee. This is very important to Jerry. But you're never going to learn the signals. Oh, come on. Of course I will. Give me another chance. Start from the beginning. Oh, all right. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Offside. <laughs> Illegal motion. Unsportsmanlike conduct. <laughs> Illegal forward pass. <laughs> Holding. <laughs> right. Backfield motion. <laughs> Personal foul. <laughs> Flipping. <laughs> uh, roughing the kicker. <laughs> Penalty refused. <laughs> Touchdown. <laughs> Offside. Backfield motion. <laughs> Holding. Unsportsmanlike conduct. <laughs> roughing the kicker. <laughs> Personal foul. <laughs> Offside. <laughs> Illegal motion. I just want to know one thing. What's the signal for timeout for the referee? <laughs> Please step forward. Forward for the toss. 
Here we go. Now you two fellows want to shake? Okay, here we go. And heads it is. Now, which team kicks and which team receives? Aunt Lucy, what? you're supposed to tell one of us to call heads or tails. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, here we go now. Call it, Tony. Tails! <laughs> Where'd he go? <laughs> Come on, fellas, help me find the penny. <laughs> Must be in here someplace. I didn't see it. Well, never mind. I got another penny in my purse. Viv, can I have my purse, please? Oh, boy, a referee with a purse. <laughs> I got some change in here someplace. Oh, boy, these bags, I tell you. You can get an awful lot in them, but you just never can find anything when you need it. Well, you want to hang on to that for me, please? <laughs> oh, picture of the kids. <laughs> yeah. Just hang on to that for a minute. I got some change down the bottom here. Help me with it. Here it is. I got it. Okay, put it all back. Thanks a lot. There we go. Thank you. Would you get off the field, lady? No one's allowed on the field. <laughs> Okay, fellas. Here we go now. You call it. Tails. Tails it is. We'll receive. We'll take that goal and kick off. Okay. They're gonna receive and they're gonna kick. <laughs> Try to remember that. Again, this time I'll watch. <laughs> Set. One, two. And my Jerry! 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 And my This is the most embarrassing day in my entire life. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, honey. Imagine having to forfeit a game because of a crooked referee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, honey, I'm sorry. Why don't we all move to another town and start a new life? <laughs> Fellas, can you ever forgive me? I doubt it. I'm with Jerry. On account of you, nobody gets to go to the pro game Sunday. Oh, Viv, did you see their faces? What can I do? Maybe you should move to a new town and start a new life. <laughs> I know how I can make it up to him. How? 
I'll take all the kids, both teams, to the game at Yankee Stadium Sunday. Well, now, that's very noble of you, dear, but where are you going to get the money for 25 tickets to a football game? I can do it if you help me. Now, Lucy, you know I'm broke. I don't want your money. All I want you to do is promise not to complain if I serve spaghetti for a month. Spaghetti for a whole month? Oh, come on, Viv, it's for the kids. Well, all right. But only if you agree to throw in a meatball on Sundays. Oh, thanks, Viv. <laughs> Jerry Sherman! You sure have a big heart. Uh-huh. And after a month of spaghetti, I'll have hips to match. <laughs> hey, kids. I got a great idea. Is it anything like the last one? <laughs> no, Jerry, it's a lot better. Just to make up for all my bad refereeing, I'm going to take all the kids, both teams, to the game at Yankee Stadium next Sunday. Oh, boy! Now, look, you go upstairs and call everybody in town to be here. Nine o'clock, Sunday morning, ready to go. Okay. Okay? Hey, we got to go to the game! Yay! <laughs> you know something, Lucy? For a crooked referee, you're a pretty nice mother. Uh... <laughs> gets here with the station wagon. I sure wish he'd hurry. Yeah, me too. We're gonna have a lot of fun, though. We're gonna be all wrapped up in nice warm blankets, and we're gonna be drinking gallons of hot chocolate. We're Lucy? gonna have a ball. What? Can I see you for a minute? Yeah. <laughs> you guys are so We'll be nice. gone too, kid. It's all off. What are you talking about? That was Harry calling. He was down at the filling station having chains put on his tires, and they told him that all the roads to New York are closed on account of the blizzard. Oh, no. What are the boys going to say? I haven't any idea. Well, you go on in and tell them and let me know. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> Why should I tell them? <laughs> well, it's only fair. I got us into this. You get us out. <laughs> Lucy! Quiet just a minute. I, I have some wonderful news. We're, we're, we're not going to have to sit out in this awful blizzard getting soaked to the skin, fighting off pneumonia by drinking ice cold hot chocolate. <laughs> all the roads to New York are closed, so we're going to stay right here in this nice warm living room and watch the game on television. How does that sound, gang? <laughs> He's got the football now, and he's fading back, back. He shoots it, and it looks like, yes, Phillips has it. He starts to run, and he's tackled now on the 35, and it's a first down. He moves down to the 40, the 30, and it's pulled down around the 25-yard line. pretty well. They seem to be having as much fun as if they were at the game. The way they're eating, I'm sure their stomachs don't know the difference. <laughs> well, the game will be over soon. Well, I should think it would be. It seems to me that game's been on so long, they must be playing two out of three. <laughs> well, cheer up. They'll be going home soon. Hello. Oh, hi, Chris. What? Oh. Oh. Yeah, well, I'll talk to you later. Okay, dear. Oh, dear. What's the matter with Chris? She's staying over at Cynthia's all night. What's so unusual about that? She can't get home. Because of the blizzard, the roads are impassable. Nobody's going anywhere. <laughs> Nobody's going anywhere? That's right. At all? <laughs> That's right. Not you, not me, and not one of those 25 dear little chaps in the living room. <laughs> oh. 
I have a feeling that before this weekend is over, we're gonna wish that angry mob had caught us. <laughs> well, they're all bedded down, and believe it or not, they're asleep. Where'd you put them all? All over the place. The house looks like there's been a leak at Boys Town. <laughs> we better get to bed ourselves. We gotta get up early and feed the troops. Yeah, I'm beat. So am I. Come on. Thank you.